In this video, I'll show you how to transfer data from Torontech B400 to PC. Before transferring the Torontech B400 data to the computer, make sure you have already installed the SP02 Assistant and you have the red heart icon. Make sure you have already recorded the data on your Torontech B400. Please refer to the related video on how to activate recording. Please note at every recording session, the old data on the device will be overwritten by the new data. If you need old data, it is important to transfer them to the PC before starting with new recording session. You have to stop the recording before you try to transfer the data. Make sure you switch on the oximeter unit and connect the unit through the USB cable with the PC. Only use the original cable which you have received in the device package. Open the SPO2 Assistant by clicking the red heart icon. In the software homepage, you will see an icon to connect the device. Click on that. Make sure your oximeter is on and the software will automatically find the device name. You can also manually refresh to look for the device. This step is the most important one. Select the device by highlighting it and at the bottom select by View Device Stored Data Only before hitting Connect. Next window will automatically pop up showing the username in the table. Make sure you select the username by ticking the box. You can also see the recorded data duration and time it was recorded. Hit Receive Data. You will see a quick upload process and prompt saying that the data has been stored on your PC. Hit OK and you will be redirected to the software home screen. Select Open File. You will see that all the previous files which had been transferred to your PC. All the files are recorded in a folder which had been set by default when the software was installed. Note: These files are recognizable by the software. Select the file you have just downloaded. You can find that out by checking the date and the time. Hit Open. You will see the report on the screen. You can simply exit out of the report or you can go to the report tab and find out about the different reporting format. You can even print the report or save it as PDF through the print interface in case you will need to email it. In case you need to access the report in the future on the same PC, simply open the software. In the home screen, you will find the open folder option and click on that. Select the name of the file you want to open and hit open. In case the first step, you do not see the device name showing up, watch the troubleshooting video.